Dick Justice here bringing you the review for Transformers Generations Whirl. He is one crazy motherfucker. Um, Whirl is a helicopter. He's got a lot of guns. Um, I did not apply the stickers to mine because when I do that it looks like a five-year-old did it. Um, there's four different guns here. This one this one, this one, and this one, and they all have pegs and C-clips, and yeah, uh, the propeller spins, the other propeller spins, whirl, um, you can unpeg his legs, and unfold the arms and slide this back and slide this under. Fold his feet down. And the trick on the feet, which I will show on this side, is that you flip the blue piece out and then you can pull down. You almost want to use the, the blue piece as a lever to make the foot happen. And you want to um, they actually ratchet out two here but I like to just keep it at one because it's such a stiff ratchet and you can fold out Whirl's hands and this is heliped mode not to be confused with helipad mode which is on generation metroplex's shoulder um, it's, eh, it, it is what it is. It looks like somebody stopped about halfway through. The, the guns can peg on. We'll get to that in robot mode. Uh, robot mode, you unpeg the tail, pull the legs back down, uh, split this canopy bit in the back here. Yeah, split it. And then, uh, that folds back, and then uh, the tail comes up, and these fins here have some slots inside here, and that's how that closes up. Then you fold the blade in half. And then the other thing I like to do to make him look a little bit less ridiculous is you can push the shoulders in and it's usually much easier than this but I'm looking at it at a weird angle. So this is Whirl in robot mode. Uh, he's, he's pretty cool. Looks a lot like his G1 self. Um, size here he is with masterminds bovis in foot mode and the riddler um, decent size a little bit small for a voyager but what he lacks in size he makes up in so, just being solid like he doesn't feel as hollow as some other figures recently um, as for gun mounting points, uh, this gun can peg in. There's a peg hole down there. Um, this is kind of cool. You can fold his hand back up, and then this gun... How does it go? It slides on like this, so he can have a blaster hand. I guess that's like a comic thing. I, I don't know. I don't read them. Then uh, there's plenty of C-clips, and then these can go on his legs here. So he ends up being pretty crazy with all of his guns and whatever, considering he's just kind of a periwinkle helicopter otherwise. Uh, pretty cool toy, though. I, I dig it. Transformers Generations World.